guys, welcome to Shaq's World. My name is Shaq. We have another fantastic sunny day in Sydney, Australia. Today I'll be telling you guys why I didn't like police officers from the age of 17 until about last week. And I will actually be donating some money to New South Wales Police Legacy as well. Before that guys, smash the subscribe button and hit the notification bell for upcoming videos. So, you guys might be wondering why I never liked police officers. Well, when I first got my license at the age of 17 until about the age of 25, I kept on getting fines from police officers. So speeding fines, license suspensions, turn left without the indicator on, going through a stop sign, having no peep lights on, and the record just goes on and on. It's probably two or three pages long. So I used to think, you know, police officers have nothing better to do but to raise revenue for the state government, um, go out, hand out tickets that's why I used to think they do which is not true the reason they're doing what they're doing is is because whenever you hear about a bad accident uh, people ending up in comas or people passing away when they're riding is because they're always first on the scene so when you're first on the scene you see that many accidents mentally it gets to you so when you see someone who's speeding you you end up giving someone a harsher penalty so you might give them a speeding ticket take their car off them or take their bike off them um, confiscate their license if you like so that's the reason why they do what they do and another reason why it changed the way I think about cops is is because two weeks ago I lost my wallet and my phone was inside my wallet as well and there was three credit cards inside and my driver's license so I went to my local police station I gave a statement my friends like don't even worry about it. my friend and my brother said look don't even worry about it because they're too busy handing out fines raising revenue for the government still in the taxpayers money they're not even going to chase it just buy a new phone and forget about it for me the issue is not the phone it's, it was a Samsung Galaxy S7 it's like 100 or 200 dollar phone the reason was I had so many videos and pictures inside that phone that was the important part and whoever found my phone and my credit cards as well what they done is they used two of my credit cards um, to go out so they went to the 7-eleven they bought stuff they went um, they caught a cab with my credit card they even went to the massage parlor they paid with my credit card as well um, so if the guy is that found my phone or my wallet because I called my phone maybe 50 or 100 times in the same night they would have gave me a call and said look we found your phone but we want $100 I would have gave him $200 as a gift but they didn't do that so Blake Robinson senior counsel Blake Robinson gave me a call he said we identified the people that have been using your cards um, so we're actually going to press charges on them I never thought the police, a police officer will go that far just to find my wallet and my credit cards. So, as a thank you to New South Wales Police, I would like to donate some money. Guys, please smash the subscribe button and hit the notification bell for upcoming videos. Thank you.